Jamie says, I have made a lot of your things. I still love the pieces, but I want to change the colors a bit. Do you recommend I do anything to them if I want to make them lighter or white? First of all, Jamie, I say we feel your pain because that is, Ashley painted her kitchen cabinets within a year of moving in her house. They've been painted twice <laughs> in three years. I will say we just shared a video on four different finishes. Those are, the painting options are super great for, for starting with something that's already stained. That chalk paint, you don't even have to put a primer down on. You just go over it and then, you know, the vast, I guess it just kind of depends on how distressed you yeah, are. Yeah, go watch that video because you can, we show you how you can distress it if you want to and then it doesn't even have to be a perfect paint mm -hmm. job. And there's a great poly that you can put on top of it if you use the chalk paint. So go watch that video. Yeah, a light distressing covers a world of sin. Your kids knock it over and like put a ding in it and it was supposed to be there. We've got eight kids going on nine with Whitney's on the way. We build everything distressed because if it gets nicked, it doesn't matter. That's right. <laughs> okay. Bridget says, I have refinished a number of wooden tables, but have never built something. I'm intimidated by it. Which projects are the most beginner? Great question. Do you want to start with this one? Yeah, I say, we always say start out with a DIY, very crafty project. We have a ton of them on our website. If you go to DIY crafts, most of them require one or two tools. Mm -hmm. But we also tell people if, if you've got the tools, go ahead and start with the dining table. I think. Probably the number one project that people say, this was my first build, is, is a, a dining, dining table. table. Seriously, mm -hmm. every person that I'm friends with that I know has gone to the store and they've bought the tools that they need for a mm -hmm. dining table on our website and that has been the first piece of furniture they bought. Yeah, it's crazy. Even our brother-in-law, when we went down to Houston and kind of redid their home, like two weeks later we get a text message with a picture and he's like, hey, I built my first build and it was their dining table. And guys, it's the hardest table I have built. He built it and that's his first project. So. I just think a lot of times they seem big and huge, but they're also a great beginner build because most of them are pretty straightforward cuts. There's not a whole lot of cuts. I would so. say that about a dining table for sure. Some of them can be very beginner, and I also think um, headboards. Oh yeah, a lot of people think yeah. because it's big that it's hard, and that's not the case. Yeah. Like Whitney said, there's less cuts. Mm -hmm. There's more room for error if you mess up. Most of the cuts are the same size, yeah. so that's good. All right, great question.